local high schoolers raised nearly $390,000 for the Children's Miracle Network last year through Kids Helping Kids pageants like Mr. Lancer, Mr. Wolverine, and Mr. LHS. KEZI 9 News anchor Brandy Smith shows us how this year's efforts got started today. The buses came from as far away as Reedsport for the 2013 Kids Helping Kids kickoff conference. Before things even got started Monday morning, the room buzzed with nervous energy. It was filled with dozens of high school girls and their pageant coordinators from Harrisburg to Reedsport to Sheldon, ready to kick off the new Kids Helping Kids season. We do a big conference every year to help them get prepared for the year. We try to give them tools and skill sets that will help them beyond just the pageant. Tools like public speaking. So my first tip is to know your material. Interviewing and letter writing are invaluable for these young women. They are, after all, the brains behind the pageants that raise hundreds of thousands of dollars for Children's Miracle Network. Like Mr. Irish. They don't always get that recognition that the boys do for being up there on stage and kind of making fools of themselves. So we try to give them a little bit of love um, and let them know that they're really a huge and important piece of the success of Kids Helping Kids and Helping Children's Miracle Network. The pageants are still a few months away. Every school is different. Everyone has a different timeline. But now they're all off to a great start. We try to at least kick off the year because the pageants really start in, in March. And so we want to, you know, get them prepared and get them excited too about what's about to come. Pleasant Hills Community Center played host to the conference on Monday. The town's Mr. Billy pageant is scheduled for April 27th. In Pleasant Hill, I'm Brandi Smith, KZI 9 News.